breaking news from CBS 17 News. Breaking tonight, the town of Kinley is going almost one month without a police department, and now they're going to be without another town leader. Good evening, everyone. I'm Rod Carter. I'm Angela Taylor. Thanks for joining us. As CBS 17's Galat Malamed reports tonight, the town council decided after a special meeting to part ways with the town manager. We looked at the best way for the town to move forward. Kenley Mayor Herbert Tui Hales says that's why the town council voted to terminate town manager Justine Jones. And sometimes things just don't fit well, and uh, we just don't feel like we were moving in the right direction. Could you provide a specific example of. I'm not going to get into personnel right matters. The move comes about six weeks after the entire police department and two town staff members resigned. In close session, the council received the results of an investigation into the resignations that the town attorney oversaw. Some of the resignation letters cite a hostile work environment. Hale says the investigation's findings did not justify a hostile work environment, and the decision to terminate Jones wasn't based only on the investigation. Denise Bennett questions what changed since Jones was unanimously picked from a nationwide search about three months ago. And now she doesn't fit for some reason. And and all they can say is we're going to vote and that's it. As for the police department leaving, Pamela Hall wants to know. Why did they leave? What, what was the reason they left here? I mean, some had to be bad for the whole Crew to leave. We spoke to people who said we want answers, just what could have been so bad for the police to resign. Will the people of Kenley ever get that answer? That's a good question, but you know, without getting into he said, she said, uh, you know, that, that sometimes it's hard to get to the answer. Hills wouldn't give details on what the investigation found, saying the town attorney has it. Now, the town manager says she may talk to us and issue a statement tomorrow. Meanwhile, Hale says that the town will be hiring a new chief to help build the department and would not consider rehiring former Chief Josh Gibson or the other officers who resigned. For now, Johnston County deputies are patrolling that area.